So guys, it's super late in the night right now for me on the East Coast, but the Warriors and Clippers just finished an absolute thriller. Steph Curry continues to show why he's a top 10 player of all time, maybe even top 5. He had another 50 bomb, and he was the reason the Warriors were in this game. Outside of Curry, nobody else on the Warriors roster had over 20 points, and honestly, that's not going to cut it in the playoffs. I don't think we should be too worried about this team. I know they're capable. I know they're going to turn on the Jets when it is April, but it is a little concerning to see that Curry is the only one playing at a superstar level right now for this team. I guess I need to take back my words a little bit though, because Klay Thompson has been on fire as of late. Anyways, going over to the LA Clippers side of things, Kawhi Leonard had 30 points, 8 rebounds, 5 assists, 2 steals, and also a plus 14 plus minus on 10 of 19 shooting. This was a big and much needed win for the Clippers, they had all around production from everyone who played. Westbrook had a decent game, he shot 6 of 16 but he had a plus 10 plus minus and had 15 points, 9 rebounds and 7 assists, not far off from a triple double. The Clippers have struggled to get wins since they acquired Westbrook, you can call it the Westbrook effect, but either way, he's playing really well right now and I hope the Clippers can continue to get wins. Also, Paul George had 24 points and 7 assists but he shot 8 of 21. This was just overall one of the most fun games of the night to watch. Steph Curry is just unbelievable. It would really be something if Golden State ended up matching up with the Clippers in the playoffs. They would probably have to be the 4 and 5 seed for that to happen, but there's definitely a chance. Anyways, that's all I have to say in this one. Let me know in the comments below what you thought about this game, and until next time, I'll see you all later.